Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's episode, I will show you how we can make a healing spell using the Unity Particle System. So we will start by creating a new particle system. So right click and create particle system. Rename it to healing spell. Reset its transform. Now here create a new material and rename it to base underscore mat. In the shaders, go to legacy shaders, particles and additive. Now I will duplicate this material by pressing Ctrl D and I will rename this new material as center underscore mat. I will duplicate this again and I will rename it to light underscore mat. Duplicate it one more time and rename it to vertical cuts. Let's reduce the size a little bit. Now I will import my sprites that I have on my PC that I will use in this project. And let's select them and click on alpha is transparent apply so that you can see them so now let's give them a little space now you can see them properly now I will drag and drop these textures into my material so inside my base material I will drag and drop this shape spell in the center material, I will drag and drop this one. Uh, in light, I will drag and drop this one. And inside vertical cuts, I will drag and drop this one. Okay. After that, I will drop my base material onto the healing spell. So this is how my healing spell would look. Now I have to change some properties from here. So the duration will be 3, lifetime 3, start size 10 and start color will be blue. Something like this. The max particles will be 3. After that go to renderer and from here change the render mode to billboard to horizontal billboard set the max particle size to 3 now go back to the top inside emission set 1 inside color over lifetime set something like this or Start speed will be 0 and start size will be 10. Let's arrange the camera so that we can see it from a little bit above. Uncheck shape. Inside size over lifetime, we'll set a graph like this. Rotation over lifetime, 90. Now check lights. Ratio will be 1, range will be 20, intensity will be 1 and maximum lights will be 1, intensity can be 4. Ok now we will create a new light and light and point light. 
range will be 4 and intensity can be 1. Now drag and drop this point light here. After that, now duplicate your particle system by pressing Ctrl D. Uh, remove this light and rename it to center. Make it a child of our healing spell. After that, drop the second material onto it. So this is how it looks. Set its size to 7 and uncheck lights. Now here change max particles to 1 and here as well. After that, duplicate the center particle system by pressing Ctrl D and rename it to particles. And set the duration to 5. The start lifetime will be random between two constants and the value will be 0 0.2 and 5. Start speed will be random between two constants and it will be 0 0.1 and 0 0.5 0 0.1 and let's change it to 1.5 start size will be also random between two constants and we will put the value of 0 0.1 and 4 max particles will be 50 and set the emission to 50 so we can see our particles moving above but they are not having any shape and moreover they don't have any material drop onto them so drop your light material on them after that click on shape and the shape will be cone Set the X position to minus 90 and uh, angle will be 25, radius will be 2 and uh, after that change the renderer to billboard. I think the start size is a bit too big, we'll have to change it. Later on, check velocity over lifetime and set its linear to random between two constants. Put the values minus one, minus one, and minus one. Change size of a lifetime to something like this. After that, uncheck rotation over lifetime and let's reduce the size. Change it to 0 0.4. Okay, now they are looking good. Now duplicate this particle system. Set the lifetime to 0 0.2 and 5. Set the speed to 5 and 2. Size will be 0 0.3 and 0 0.7. Max particles will be 100 and rate over time will be 10. Inside shape, the angle will be 0 and the radius will be 1. Rename it to vertical cuts. Uncheck velocity over lifetime and change the renderer to stretched billboard. Set the length scale to 2 if it is not set to 2 and drop your vertical cuts material onto it. And restart it. 
so this is how it looks so that's all about it this is how we make a healing spell using the unity particle system i hope you enjoyed the video make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our youtube channel for weekly interesting videos we will see you in a new video